For the past few years, senior Chase Holtman has stood out as one of Millard West's top multi-sport athletes, even having aspirations of taking his talents to the Division I level. But on October 22nd, everything changed. So I just felt my knee like kind of like snap and I just fell down. Holtman tore his ACL in the final game of the football season, lending him on the bench for the entirety of the basketball season. However, staying off the court hasn't kept Holtman from contributing to the team. So our team's super young, so I've just been trying to help out the younger guys and get them used to the speed of the game and understanding what's going on better. His time on the sidelines has strengthened his relationships with the coaching staff in a unique way. He's trying to stay as positive as he can. He helps in any way in practice that he can. He's given me some tidbits about some players that we might be playing that we don't know, um, helping with just ideas that he's had. But he's trying to stay loose and, and being, that, being that cheerleader on the sideline. I know it's rough, but he's doing the best he can. One relationship in particular stood out for Holtman. Nick's definitely been a good distraction, good and bad. Nicholas Wright, the team manager, has become good friends with Holtman and kept him positive in this tough situation. Shooting around here and talking about guys subbing girls up. While Holtman won't be fully recovered until July, he still wants to keep his college athletic chances alive. I still might walk on at Creighton for basketball. For the MWHS Wildcat News, this is Ben Brooks, Liva, and Evan Vasla.